Uh, I just want to say a happy 100th birthday to the Schubert Theater. Um, I was blessed to play there with uh, the Duke Ellington Orchestra, Mercer uh, Ellington. It was his last American tour uh, before he passed on. I feel very blessed to have been with him to Guys and Dolls and Little Women and also for when the Schubert slept. Uh, when the, it was, the theater was renovated and uh, it was the grand opening, so to speak, and um, I got to s share a dressing room with Gwen Verdon. It was one of the thrills of my life. One of the most amazing women on the planet who told me that dancers die twice. Once when they actually pass on and once when they don't, cannot dance again. And I remember it was just, I got tears in my eyes. She, just, she was just an amazing woman. And Richard Kiley, uh, Richard Kiley and I, uh, we all took turns introducing things at the performance of, of when the Schubert slept. And I was standing next to Richard Kiley and he did his little spiel that he had to say. And when I started mine, he turned to me and whispered, oh so softly, sotto voce, a, a slew of obscenities. <laughs> And I had to keep a straight face and say, so if you have it on tape somewhere, I, if, if I look a little cross-eyed, I mean, I was married to a musician, so I, you know, been around musicians my whole life. I thought I'd heard everything, but anyway, very, I was not offended. It was very impish and funny. Anyway, but I digress. There are, there are theaters around the country and around certainly around the world but certainly in this country like Carnegie Hall and uh, other particularly symphony halls where you, you can can feel the presence of those who have been there before you can feel their exu their exhilaration their panic their <laughs> uh, fears all of that is center stage and in, in uh, theater houses and, and symphony houses uh, the Schubert is one because so many legendary uh, theater pieces were born on that very stage so uh, it was a thrill just to step set foot on that very stage so here's to the schubert may you reign an, at least another hundred years or more